I was sitting at home uh, reading a book uh, on a Monday. And uh, all of a sudden I felt, I didn't feel well. I knew something wasn't right. I was at work and he called and said, I don't feel good. Before I could even leave the office, he called back and he said, I feel like something's standing on my chest. You've got to get home. And so I rushed out the door, and um, when I got home, I found him in the bathroom floor. Uh, something you don't expect at 33. My name is Todd Pettit. I live in Jonesboro, Arkansas, and I've got a, a wife, uh, 32 years. Uh, her name is Karen. Daughter, Lindsay, is 16 years old. It took me a long time to where I could tell that story. I mean, it, it really did. I didn't talk about it for years, and I'll talk about it now. I started having severe chest pains, uh, neck pain, jaw pain, uh, all the classic signs of the heart attack. That's pretty much all I remember at that point. Next thing I remember is a nurse in the ER at the time screaming, fight, fight, fight. And I remember telling Karen, I said, I know what kind of shape I'm in. Uh, I may not make it, I love you. And uh, told her father to take care of her. I think my nurse role kicked in and it really didn't hit me till later. Uh, it can happen to anybody at any age. Uh, don't ignore the signs. Uh, if you've got a family history, I, I, kid, I kid about it every now and then. I'll say my dad didn't leave me a cotton farm, he left me heart disease. It has been 20 years. He was pretty strong with me, uh, he, as, he, he, as he can be. And he told me I needed to get to the gym, get a trainer, and start exercising. And I did that, and it, it was very helpful to me. Uh, Dr. Tedder, he's, he's determined as well. He, I don't always like what he says to me, but he does get results. And uh, couldn't say enough about him. He's been tremendous uh, to me and my family. St. Bernard's fulfills their mission, and they have taken care of so many of my family, um, not just immediate family, but extended family. It's the only place I feel to go.